As global energy demands continue to rise, new sources such as wind and solar enable a diverse, secure and sustainable energy mix. Grid operators are meeting this demand through the efficient integration and transfer of renewable energy. Here in Caros, France, one community is experiencing the future of the grid firsthand. So the city of Caros is located at the edge of the French territory on the Côte d'Azur. And uh, this city is, uh, was quite interesting because it features quite different type of customers. In this region, there is only 10% generation compared to the consumption, which makes the region very dependent on the transmission lines, so dependent on the other regions. And it is uh, highly exposed uh, potentially to uh, failures into these uh, main lines. And very often, when, especially in the peak periods, when you have a lot of population here, uh, this uh, can turn into uh, blackouts or brownouts in the region. Here we are uh, prototyping a, a new environment, uh, which is what's going to be the city of tomorrow, which is going to be uh, equipped uh, with a lot of uh, new energy production resources. The Nashville project has uh, four uh, main objectives. The first objective of the project is to be able to integrate tomorrow much more photovoltaic generation on the distribution grid. The second objective is to be able to reduce the peak demand in winter uh, between 6 and 8 p.m. using batteries but also using demand side management at the customer premises. The third objective is to operate islanding. It means like disconnecting a low voltage district from the main grid and operate it for a limited duration of time only with photovoltaic generation and energy storage. And the last objective is to give to the residential customers as well as industrial customers a new role, the role of prosumer, an active role in the distribution grid. Malongo is a French uh, coffee brewing uh, company, uh, historically developing environmental friendly coffee. Nous sommes ici chez Malongo, euh, sur la zone industrielle de Carros, située près de Nice et du petit village de Carros. Nice Grid, c'est un programme euh, assez particulier, très innovant et euh, qui est destiné à effacer euh, les pointes de consommation électrique au moment euh, où euh, le réseau risque de, de sauter. I think this was a win-win situation between the project and their own uh, corporate strategy. We equip 2,500 customers with a smart meter linky in order to be able to have a better knowledge of what's happening on the distribution grid as well as to be able to control remotely some appliances for the residential customers. J'étais le premier de, du lotissement à vouloir du solaire. Alors l'intérêt de cette euh, expérimentation, c'est de pouvoir utiliser l'excédent de production euh, solaire qui est dans le coin où, euh, de l'expérimentation, de manière à, le, à faire des économies sur le reste. L'idéal, c'est d'arriver à faire des îlots comme ça, où on, on peut, comme surtout en cette période, on a des problèmes avec l'énergie, C'est super bien si on arrive à, comme ça, à faire des réserves d'énergie d'électricité pour les redonner à, à d'autres moments. Ce nous a apporté un changement d'habitude dans notre consommation de tous les jours. It is a success from various perspectives. I think for the consumer and people here in that area, the success has been to anticipating new business model and also trying to realize the value of data and information, being able to manage energy, uh, manage energy efficiency, and basically manage the carbon footprints associated to their own individual behaviors and their business operations. And that's why we will start at the, the end of 2016 a new project based on an Asquid project extending on, the, on a larger area with also further partners in order to make our new technology, our new model, 
more scalable and to enhance uh, the existing business model. And that's true for rapid developing economies such as India or China, but that's also true for mature economies like Europe and, and, and US. What I really find exciting into that project is everywhere you go in the world, they, everyone talks about the third industrial revolution around energy, renewables, and I got the impression that uh, we're kind of contributing to uh, building this uh, new vision of the energy system, and as a group we really uh, invented something which is new, I'm, I'm very sure of that.